Oh, sorry about that. Yo, what's going on, YouTube? All right, let's get back into the videos. So, there's some things that you got to do even before you start thinking about buying a truck. Let me shut this thing off. And I'm going to recommend two books to read. First book is Rich Dad, Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. And the other book is Who've Moved My Cheese. Uh, look up the title. I don't remember the author's name. So that's Rich Dad, Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. And the other title is uh, Who Moved My Cheese. Eat the meat, spit out the bones. That's all. And just apply it to trucking. All right. So even before you buy your truck, even start thinking about buying a truck, you got to start setting up your your network and the people that you're going to work with. So where are you going to park your truck at? So you got to find some place to park a truck. You know, if you had a truck, where are you going to park it at? Um, how far away is that lot going to be? Where are you going to park it at? Um, that you know, that's just stuff you got to think about. Um, you know, another again, business structure. How are you going to structure your business? Sole proprietor, LLC, S corp, or C corp. Uh, each one has their advantages and disadvantages. Um, who are you going to work for? Uh, are you going to go out and get your own authority? I know I, I talked about this before, but are you going to get your authority? Or are you going to lease to a company and just pull their trailers or run under their authority? Uh, what area do you live in? If you live in the big city, to where you can be home every night uh, and you want to go that route or do you live miles and hundred thousand not hundred thousand but you know three four hundred miles away from civilization to where you got to run outside of your 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 general area I mean these are all things that you got to think about I mean and once you get all that stuff set up then you can worry about the money but uh, before that you that stuff that you got to work on you know beforehand um, and you want to network with people within your industry of, of where you're gonna where you're gonna be running. So uh, dry van, you know, I would work if you're gonna be calling dry van. I would network with you with people uh, that call dry van. Call companies up that do dry van. If you're the same way with reefer, you know, if you're gonna run reefer, run a reefer. You know, start calling companies, making contacts. Um, if you're working for a company that hires owner operators, talk to your company. I mean, it's, I mean, this, it's not rocket science. I mean, it's the information out here that people put out will make it a lot harder than what it is. But I mean, once you get your bases down, uh, it's, I'm not going to say it's easy, but it's pretty much straightforward. Everything pays the same. Everything pays the same. It's how you, it's how you have your, your company, your business structured, and how you, how you manage your funds, and how you manage your time is going to, is going to determine how much your truck makes and then in return is going to determine how much you make as an employee of your company hint 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 so go check those books out start network networking with people uh, uh, who's going to work on your truck I don't know if I mentioned that who's going to work on your truck um, if you have a newer truck, I don't know, can't help you. Uh, if you have an older truck, you might want to talk to older owner operators 
and find out where they get their trucks worked on if they don't work on them themselves. Is that what you want to hear right now? I don't know. I just, you know, this is these are steps that I did even before I even, you know, started looking at looking at trucks to buy. Well, I started looking at trucks to buy, but before I started getting, you know, serious to go out and actually, you know, I'm not going to say take the leap, but make the investment in, in buying a truck. Um, Shalom.